What's up everybody and welcome back to Timothy Hennick. Today I just wanted to show you guys something I figured out and I'm almost certain that someone else has probably figured this one out by just messing around but that's what exactly what I've just done just messed around so let's just get to it and let me show you what I'm doing on Skyrim here this is the Xbox One edition Alright, so first of all, I'm going to go over here and I'm going to save before I lockpick, I'm um, not lockpick, but pocket pick. And I've given this guy this, and they never carry these, hardly ever. It's very rare if you see a guard with this sort of thing. So I'm just going to take that back. Oh. Okay, well, that's why I saved it. So, if you get caught like I just did, you simply load it back up, and it, you know, it just takes you back to where the save point was. <clears throat> you know, I'm surprised this isn't you know, working. <laughs> this is weird. Okay. Okay, there. There we go. Okay. So, I was doing that while he was shooting. So, what you do... I don't know why I did that. I'm gonna give him my ebony arrow. Press... Well, for Xbox, you press X to give. And there we go. So now he's just going to be using those. I'm going to take these and watch what happens. I'm going to leave him alone let him practice. All he needs is one. They got infinite. And then, see this? You can just take it. One super fast way of literally getting all the arrows that you need. It does take some time just watching them. You know, just shoot like this. But believe me, if you don't have the skill set for, you know, making these, um, it doesn't take a whole lot of time. What is it called? Uh, smithing. If you don't have good smithing skills like I don't right at the moment, and you you know you can't make those types of arrows, well, this is the best way to do it. Find you know find one and try to you know steal the arrows they have and just give them one of them like I did. I only had one as you guys saw, and just. Take them. It's not stealing, because if it was, he would be, you know, trying to arrest you and everything. And if you want, you can just leave him alone. Walk around, do whatever you want. I want to come down here. Okay. I just want to do that for the heck of it. <clears throat> this is Solitude, in case you all are wondering. I'm going to come back over here. Uh, 
Okay, that should have been a lot more than just two, but if you're if you got the patience everybody, you can just literally wait and do that. Just stand here and take all those arrows. Alright guys, well I hope this educated you guys on how to get arrows. I'm just going to stand here and take a few more of these. But yeah, as you, like I said guys, look at that. I got 19 and I only had one. So yeah, literally just take the time, stand there and... There you go. Easy way of getting any kind of arrows that you need in Skyrim without having to make them. Um, my only suggestion is take a little bit of time <clears throat> to max out your pickpocketing skills. And as you see, mine's one... Um, Level 100 maxed out. Legendary. That's the very f first thing I always max out when I start this game. Because it's super simple. And if you guys want to learn how to max this out within an hour. I will show you where to go. Well, where at least where I go specifically. And who to pickpocket from. And show you the technique that I use that helps. And you 100%, if you do this correctly without making a mistake, 100% of the time, you will get away with it. Therefore, you won't have to worry about fighting a whole town. You won't have to be chased down. You won't have to worry about being killed. Nothing like that. If you follow my instructions. But leave a comment below and let me know if you guys want that type of video. On how to max this out and even how to get legendary. You can even continue leveling up. If you, you know, really like my technique uh, on how to do the, uh, how to max it out without getting caught 100% of the time. Which honestly, I've already showed you basically what to do and how to do it, just by um, stealing from him the arrows, the arrow that I gave him before, in the very beginning of this video. So, anyway, I'm gonna stop talking now. I showed you guys exactly what to do when you have um, low arrows and you really want to get um, better ones or more of what you're looking for and yes in case you're wondering if you made or found a dragon bone arrow which I'm 90% sure that there is dragon bone arrows but anyway I know it's on the 360 so it should be on here like I was saying guys uh Dragon bone arrows, if you can get your hands on at least one, like I said, just swap out, steal what they, steal what he has, give him just one, because that's all it's going to take is one arrow of what you, of your cho choosing, like uh, Ebony here, and just keep taking them as he shoots them. Alright guys, that's all I have to do, I mean, as far as showing you guys. This cool technique that helps you get the arrows that you need. I mean, check that out. 32, and I've only been here for, what? Sorry, I made the camera shake. About almost 10 minutes. So yeah, it does take quite a bit of patience, but like I said, if you got the patience, you can get quite a bit. And considering it took 10 minutes to just to get like 32, Multiply that. So basically in an hour. You can have close to a hundred. Or maybe literally a hundred. In a half hour. If you're that patient. Uh, but I wouldn't recommend. Um, going up and cooking something. And then coming back. Because some of them might actually disappear. Just saying. Alright. So I'm done talking. For sure. Sorry everybody. 
Leave a like if this helped you a lot. And subscribe for more, guys. If I find out any other cool techniques, I will be sure to record it and let you know. Peace, everybody.